All right, welcome back. My name is Warwick from Insaka Ecommerce Academy. Uh, today I'm going to quickly address one of the questions I got from uh, one of our consulting clients about why their business isn't listed um, on Google Maps. They we're helping them with their online store, and they've got 37 other stores around the country. Some are listed, some aren't. Um, so the answer to that question is whether or not those other shops or stores or your head office or your business address in general, whether or not that's registered and validated with Google. Um, that is how you get to appear on Google Maps, and that is also how you get to have this knowledge window, what they call the knowledge window, show up. This knowledge window is super important because it, it's an opportunity for you to give your customers, people who are searching for your brand, see it's, it's very specific to a company name. This is a company I used to run. And here we've got some images, we've got the map, um, you've got some Google reviews, which is super important for SEO. Um, that's worth it completely, just going through this process so you can have that enabled. People can click directly through to the website, um, directions, opening hours. Clicking that from your phone will link people straight through so they'll dial, dial directly to you. Um, what else, you've got popular times. You can just give customers a whole bunch of information and it's a process whereby, this is pretty cool. Um, it's a process that you can do that's pretty easy um, and it's incredibly worthwhile because you have this opportunity to have the knowledge window and you list on Google Maps so people can click for directions pretty easily. Um, what's interesting is the client that asked us this question, we are actually going through the same process ourselves. So in soccer is uh, busy being validated and it's a process which I'll explain in a minute because our knowledge window is, isn't yet showing up even though we've requested it be validated. So how do you do that? Quite simply is you go to google.co today forward slash business. That's going to take you to this window where you can start now. Um, I won't go through it now because I've just done, I've previously done it last week. Um, and it, the first step is it asks you to link to your Google account, your Gmail account. I'm sure you either have one or get one set up. That then allows you to say, this is my business, this is my email address. And you can add in the details such as um, your opening hours, your um, website address, your phone number and some photos and all the cool stuff that you want people to see when they're searching for your brand. Now, the reason that ours isn't showing yet is because they actually go through the very old school process of legitimately um, validating your address. So the way that they do that is they send you a postcard in the mail, which when you get that, it has a unique reference. You come back to this page to finalize the process. The post service, you know, that can take anywhere between, I don't know, whatever, how many days, but the code is only valid for 30 days. So you need to be quite careful that you don't run out of time. Um, so just keep an eye on your PO box, your post box, whatever, and don't let it go beyond 30 days. Otherwise you'll need to start again. Once you get that postcard, come back here, finalize the process by putting in the code and you're done. Your knowledge panel will show and your directions on Google on the map will show. And it's a, it's a good process for like a user interaction with your customers. Um, it's also super cr critical for um, SEO because Google loves you giving it more information about uh, your business, opening hours, all the direct contact details, a little bit of a bio, some pictures and stuff. It loves that stuff. And it ranks your site more, um, higher and higher because you give it all this cool info. So definitely go to the site, google.co.za forward slash business, check it out. And for more interesting tips and tricks and all this cool stuff that we do, subscribe to our YouTube channel and connect with us on Facebook and you will have more cool stuff like this to help you sell more on your website. Chat to you then.